I had not ever met her before. I'd heard about the movie and I saw Samantha Morton and I never really put the face to it. And then actually surprised us with the first screening. And when she came from the back from the back of the theater, she was just so elegant and so together and such a strong survivor. She was an immediate inspiration, knowing her story and then seeing the person and knowing what she went through. That was just, just inspiring right then, right then and there. And she's a very uh, disarming, unassuming person. You'd think she'd come out of some powerful rock star hero. She's a very gentle woman and has this inner strength. So, so she's, a, she's inspiring for both patients and medical professionals. She's someone that can help us get the word out what this whole BRCA business is about, what the genetics is about, what breast ovarian cancer syndrome is about. So she's a beacon for us because people don't like to hear doctors and scientists talk all the time. Sometimes when a patient comes forward or a movie like this comes out, it tells a story in such a more powerful way and also an entertaining and funny way, believe it or not. It's, it's, you're actually able to laugh and cry during the movie at the same time. But getting awareness out is difficult. And unfortunately in our society, it does take Hollywood stars and celebrities sometimes to get the message out. People don't read scientific journals. The news media doesn't necessarily cover these. When Angelina Jolie comes out, of course, then they cover it. But Annie Parker herself sometimes compares herself to Angelina Jolie, except she's Angelina Jolie without the benefit of genetic testing. She suffered the consequences of not having genetic testing. But if it weren't for her story and what she's done, then Angelina Jolie wouldn't have had the opportunity to make the bold decision that she made. So it's an interesting parallel, but any I don't care how the message gets out, if it's a celebrity or not, or how they come out, as long as the message gets out and helps us tell the story, I'm all for it. Hi, I'm Wendy Hartley, co-founder of Breast Cancer Answers. You know, not every breast cancer patient benefits from chemotherapy. When I was diagnosed, my doctor thought I would need chemotherapy. But then I learned about the Oncotype DX test, which helps your doctor decide if chemotherapy could benefit you based on the unique biology of your tumor. My test results revealed I had a very low chance of my cancer returning, which meant I didn't need chemotherapy after all. To learn more about the Oncotype DX test, click this button here.